Welcome to Social Regression. This video series is a self-imposed challenge to see if I can turn a budget deer rifle like this into a thousand yard competition rifle for less than $500. Now of course there will be a lot of limitations to this. A match grade rifle, for very good reason, is extremely expensive. First, you have a heavy match grade barrel that's going to dissipate heat quickly and it isn't going to whip much as it heats up. It's going to be a long barrel so you can get more muzzle velocity which is going to decrease the amount of time that the projectile spends in the air. You're going to have a target grade action and a target grade bolt and both of these will have very very tight tolerances so that the two don't float around very much. A match grade rifle will have a very light and crisp trigger which will help to create a nearly telepathic trigger pull and all of this will sit in a heavy laminate stock that's going to fit very comfortably to the shooter and is going to help to reduce a lot of that recoil and just basically keep things from moving around. An exotic high magnification scope will sit on top not only making it easy to see the target but also to see mirage and bullet trace. A handful of video producers have put together thousand yard rifles for around a thousand dollars. This rifle, for example, right here costs around $925, including everything that you see on it. But I think that I can cut this budget in half. With careful component selection and a little elbow grease, I'm fairly certain that my father-in-law and I can turn a budget deer rifle into a competent long-range precision rifle. I will document each phase of the project, from initial component selection, to rifle assembly and gunsmithing, load development, testing, and then finally, I will be competing in two matches out at Tulsa's Red Castle Gun Club. I will compete in a 600-yard match, and I will compete in a 1,000-yard F-Class match. So you won't want to miss out on any of these videos. There will be quite a few in this playlist. Be sure to subscribe so you receive instant updates when the new videos come out. If you like us on Facebook, you'll be able to look behind the scenes and maybe see some of the footage that ended up on the cutting room floor. And then on each video, we will also have a link to the full playlist. So if you want to jump back and forth to various videos to see different stages of the process, then this is probably the best way to do it. This is going to be a lot of fun, guys.